everybody. Um, today I wanted to talk about rainy season. So <clears throat> rainy season's been on my mind since we just kind of came into our rainy season and it's been, at least in the South Pacific Coast, we've had a pretty decent amount of rain. It's definitely more than at this point. Let's see, we're in June. In this May and June, I feel like we've had more this year so far than we had the last two that I was here. Um, so finally the sun's come out for a little bit. It was actually raining all morning. Um, it rained last night. It rained most of yesterday. Um, so now I'm out here enjoying some sun. Actually just taking a little work break. And yeah, so I can't, you know, rainy season can be different depending on where you are in Costa Rica. So where I am, I'm in Dominical, which is in South Pacific Costa Rica. It is yeah, on the long Pacific coast. And the weather here, our rainy season is about from April until December. So that's why a lot of the big tourist months are January, February, March, and then about till April. And then we have a little bit more people come during the summertime months in the United States. So like June, July, August, to get some people that come in too. Um, so I would say rainy season, I really love it. Especially because I work from home. It's super nice. It's kind of a... Like yesterday, it's like, oh, well, I guess I'll just work or I'm just going to chill in my house. I can't go outside anyways. And it does cool it down a little bit, so that's really pleasant. Um, and again, it just depends where you are in Costa Rica. So I know the rainy season can be a little bit different on the Caribbean side. Maybe um, we're getting a lot of sunshine here during our summer, and then it might be raining over there or vice versa. So it just depends where you are. But at least I can speak for the South Pacific, Pacific side. Um, I'm not really sure what it's like in Guanacaste. I'm guessing they get some rain too. I know they're super dry in our summer. So, um, yeah, I'm sure they get some rain as well. I would, I think rainy season is a great time to visit Costa Rica. Um, I would say one of my favorite things are, well, I, I mean, I like the rain. I think it's really nice and it's really peaceful. Everything's super green. That's something that I love and that definitely makes Costa Rica really beautiful. Also, there's less people. That's one of my other things that I enjoy too. It's nice to have new faces around, but then rainy season, it's nice because you can actually kind of get to know the people a little bit more who are around, especially when you're in a smaller town like Dominica. You're gonna notice who are the tourists and who actually live here. Another reason why I like rainy season, um, I mean, I guess for traveling on the off seasons in a lot of different countries, the tickets will be cheaper. So I would say don't let the rainy season or the thought of there being a rainy season maybe deter you from taking a trip if you're considering coming here because um, I mean there's usually lots of sunshine in the morning typically if it's gonna rain it'll rain later afternoon sometimes you get a morning drizzle but you know as the Sun starts to come out that usually goes away and occasionally yeah we'll just get kind of like a day of rain and it's really peaceful but I would say the majority of time during rainy season you can still come do all your activities. Some activities might be better. A lot of people come because the surfing's better or there's rafting. So you can still do a lot of tours and activities and not really be affected by the rain. I would just recommend that you get started early so that you have enough time in your day. What else? I guess that's all I really want to say about rainy season. I would just say just don't let it detour you from coming. Obviously, if you're going to um, plan a trip to Costa Rica, or if you're planning to move here, you will want to bring some extra supplies. I will name some of my, um, I guess like rainy season must have items. I'll put some of those in the blog. Um, I, I, could, I could just say one right now, something for your electronics to put them in just in case. Um, some people have dry sacks or dry sack backpacks. That's a good way just to make sure that your stuff will definitely not get wet. Um, also with rain comes more mold, so there's definitely some tips on how to keep your clothes fresh if you don't have air conditioning. I can share some of those too. And yeah, come and enjoy the rain. I <laughs> um, guess that's it. Until next time.